Hey everyone, what's up? I am playing Hematite Brown. I always have white against him. He plays some crazy E4 um, sharp Sicilians that I just avoid, so... That's what we're doing. Last time we played the English against him, we got a really good position. Let's see if he can improve on in that game. Just playing this reverse, um... What the it called? Reverse... Reverse Dragon? No, Reverse... Close King's Indian was called. Alright, what's this move? Does he want to go E4? I can't even, I can't remember exactly what to do. If I go B4... E4. I don't think E4 is scary. Uh, I could also just go Knight to D2. It's like a normal move in this position anyway. B4... E4... Knight H4... You know what? I'm just going to be a total wuss bag. <laughs> uh, I mean, it's a normal move anyway, so I figure whatever. I'll just do it. What do you want to know? Yeah, uh, I can go b4, bishop h3. I can switch to the e4 setup. Now I'm going to do this instead. Hmm, shit, I'm out of water. How about Brown is a person who watches the stream. I I forget his handle actually. This guy's gonna try and checkmate me. Let's do it, homie. Just one thing on his mind, checkmate. I will ignore all of his threats until I can't ignore them anymore. And then I will do something about it. Chesbra said he got very angry at what up your dog. What happened? I'm just gonna ignore everything. This opening honestly terrifies me. I always feel like I'm gonna get checkmated. But sometimes I don't, and then I do some good stuff on the queen side. But I'm always very scared, very scared. Dweezil SX6. No, it's my sister. <sighs> Whatever. All right, now what? Bishop b2? Oh, e3 is a normal kind of move, but I'll just do it. And what next? Put something on e4? Probably not. He can just go knight h7 and then push me away with f5. Uh, I think I'll just play like a bishop developing move to, to b2 maybe. The problem is, how do I proceed? It's not so easy to come up with a big plan. At some point, I might might trade bishops. I don't know. Mm, all right, I'm just going to develop it. Well, now knight e4 makes more sense. I'm actually going to do it, because I might want the bishop on c1 in some lines. And if he goes knight h7 now, there's no f5 coming at me. I also have ideas of knight g5 in, in some positions. I'm also up a minute on the clock, so I'm going to try to use that against him. He plays knight h7, but it would have been better if it's knight on, it's knight on um, e6. Should I go knight to d5 here? Just take all the squares? Yeah, I'll just see what happens. I don't know. Maybe he can just go b6. But then you'll make some weaknesses or something on his queen side. I think I'm just going to go back. Oh, then he goes d5. Was this just all, like, all really bad? Or what about knight, knight b6, queen c7... It's probably just really bad. I'm gonna do that. If D5, I, I think like or I can just take it. Oh, he gets three piece. No, I have E4 at the end. No, he has nice C3. Hmm. I know I said that very fast, but trust me, it made lots of sense. All right, let's develop a stupid piece. Still got a minute edge in the clock. 
We're threatening d6 in some positions later. It's a weird move. Uh, queen a4, he has a uh, rook a8. I think I'm just going to put a queen on, develop the queen. All right, double rooks if I can. D5, I can always go knight C5. And I want to keep this time edge. Could be important this game. I actually like my position now. Because he doesn't seem to have any real attacking chances at all. What do you do, H4? Ignore that. What does he do? Queen E6 here? Probably. Hmm. That's interesting. Feels very odd to me. Well, I, I think I'm just gonna. Oh, rook e7, queen e6 doesn't help me much. Uh. Queen e2 is like a safety move. I don't even know. Bishop g2 with the idea of rook h1 someday? That's horrible. Uh, let's just play the safety move. The queen and c2 not doing that much anyway. I should put my, maybe my bishop on b2, because king on h8. I can't seem to win this pawn on d6 ever. Mm. I'll just do this. I don't want to worry about my rook on b3. And not being able to move it. Okay, whatever. Bishop on a1, not amazing, but that's where it is. Okay, he has the a file, but he can't really use it. And he's down a lot of the time. This move looks risky. Let's attack the pawn. See what he see how he deals with it. I can just take. Okay, I'll just do it. It's a knight f6 check. He'll probably go rook b8. Oh, really? The move looks insane to me. But all right, that's what he played. Uh, I just don't even understand it at all. I feel like I'm just winning that. Whoa. Ah, uh, I don't understand what he's doing. I know I shouldn't be thinking here, but knight takes, bishop takes. What am I thinking about? Whatever. Let's trade some things. Uh, you know, I have just two extra pawns here. Should be pretty, pretty good position for me. It was probably not the most um, accurate way to win. Oh, I didn't see that. Uh, queen. Ah, oh, I just take it. Let's see, knight f6 playable, but good for me. Okay, bishop's opposite, but I might, my bishop's very strong. I'm threatening queen g6, which he missed, and I think I can take it. And we're gonna win! He can't even defend, oh, he has to go queen a1 to a7 to defend the, defend the pawn. Now it's going to make some quick, confident moves, and he'll eventually lose on time. Hmm, no trading. This is just no chance to defend. He won't give up, though. Take the last pawn. All right, we win. Yeah, I mean the key to this game was I don't know. We were up on time. Um, just kind of always seemed pretty solid for us. Like he didn't really have an attack. He had some weaknesses. I do think 
Well, I kind of expected him to play... I don't know, like I played some weird move here. Oh, well d5 wasn't playable, right? No. Whoa, take... I was, I was calculating this. He got three pieces for it. And if e4, knight c3, so I didn't... I, didn't, I probably wouldn't have done that. I probably would have done some kind of knight c5 type thing, maybe. I, I don't even know. I don't know. It just looks a little... Oh, I got bishop a3. So yeah, I would. I guess I would do something like... Something around... Along these lines. It's just... That was b6 win. I don't know. I don't know what I would have done, honestly. Let's just check with Houdini, because I'm, I'm kind of curious. Okay, it says it's good for me. Oh, I just probably likes knight d5 for some reason. Queen d2, bishop b2. I think this is just a... Yeah, stockfish generally, I think it overvalues queens a little bit, but maybe the idea is black pieces here are a little awkward. I don't know. Anyway, um, thanks everyone for watching. Got the win. Needed that one. See you next time. Bye-bye.